The mitochondrion is the site of most of the cell's energy production. After food molecules are processed in the cytosol, they enter the mitochondrion, where they are further broken down. In the citric acid cycle, the molecules are stripped of high-energy electrons, which are donated to carrier molecules, such as NADH. The carrier molecules transfer the high-energy electrons to a chain of proteins called the electron transport chain, which is embedded in the inner mitochondrial membrane. The chain acts as a pump, using the energy of the electrons to move protons from one side of the membrane to the other. The pumping creates a proton gradient across the membrane, which the mitochondrion can tap to make the fuel molecule ATP. The electron transfer begins at a multiprotein complex called the NADH dehydrogenase complex. This complex has a higher affinity for electrons than NADH and easily strips away the high-energy electrons. As the electrons are transferred from one protein to another in the complex, energy is released and used to pump protons across the membrane. Electrons are then transferred to ubiquinone, a different carrier that shuttles them to the next way station called the cytochrome BC1 complex, which again pumps protons as they flow through it. Because each complex in the chain has a higher affinity for the electrons than the previous one, the electrons keep moving through the chain unidirectionally. Finally, cytochrome C delivers the electrons to the cytochrome oxidase complex, a third proton pump. The cycle repeats until the cytochrome oxidase complex has accumulated four electrons. From there, they are handed over to molecular oxygen. Oxygen takes up the electrons as it combines with protons, forming water as a product, thereby completing the stepwise path of the combustion of the food molecules.